Hey beautiful and handsome peoples around the world. So this topic is actually going to be about what you really, what they really don't tell you while you're going through your spiritual awakening. Sorry, I was just making funny TikTok, so if I still got like my lipstick <laughs> across my face, I'll read. But um, yeah. So I just I'm I'm literally just here chilling and bored, but um, I just wanted to come and talk to you guys about some stuff. So as y'all know, my journey of going to pretty much about awakening up and just telling people about what I've been going through or just talking about stuff that I find out and if I want more information because I'm just going to recap over all the videos I post they're really pretty much for me to watch as I go through with everything so I can go back and watch for strength and all that to keep it pushing but so you guys I personally have gotten wrapped up to pretty much waiting for the next YouTuber to post a video all this you know and just like trying to get knowledge and knowledge and knowledge and stuff like that and the next tarot card reading the next tarot card reading of what I need what I need what I need and you guys with this being said all the information in the YouTubers that inspire you to do stuff take it and go do it don't wait for them to make a video every single day and have to click on it and watch it right away or just feel like you have to watch it take the information you need and go about your day and do it like like I have been going about my day and doing it but I also just got stuck to I always wanted to watch their videos and their videos and stuff like that you know um And also, your whole life is going to change the way you think and everything. So, if the people that you're around don't adapt to it, it's going to make you feel like you're never going to succeed or grow bigger than what you fully can. Because you're going to be stuck in their vibration thinking that you got to change them. And... Really, you don't really, you can't change nobody. You have to continue working on you. And that's where I'm at right now. Like, I'm stuck because I was, I was in a relationship before I started going through my spiritual awakening. So, like, now that I'm completely changing, but he met me different is hard because it's just like, he don't want to jump aboard to most of the things. And I'm just, like, stuck with him, like, not doing it, you know? So, we all are going to have to go through that and just everything and then thinking about your twin flame like is he the one and all of this and if he is you got to go through your karmic like cycles of trying to break your karma to make everything better and just and for the people that think manifesting everything and everything and everything is going to get you stuff but if you don't complete your karma cycle you're not going to get it point blank period like you have to break your karmic cycle of what you did in your past life, the reason why you're here to fix in this life. Um, but that's just some things that probably could help you guys out <laughs> through y'all's journey because it's been draining me on my journey. But I am going to actually start focusing on my wife and because the universe wants me to trust trust the universe and if y'all are like me I can't <laughs> like I literally have to know have to know like what like is this good for me like is this is this is this what is that situation about I need to know this I need to know this before I can go on oh, the blah, 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 blah. but that's gonna literally make you go crazy and with that being said Take it day by day, get the knowledge you need, and go put it in your own way. 
go be about it, go and live about it, um, tap into nature, um, don't try to change people, be you, try to make peace with those people, and then the trust in the universe, literally, like, in the situation that you're going through, just trust in the universe, and it's all going to play out, literally, and that's what I'm going through right now, trying to just trust that everything is going to go great. And I'm almost there breaking my karma. Karma. I feel it, you guys. I feel it. <laughs> but, um, yeah. Let me know how y'all cycle is going and everything or little details that they do not tell you that is driving you up the wall and crazy. <laughs> but, um, yeah. That's all I really had to say in this video, so peace. Love you guys.